everyone! I hope you are doing well. This week, curriculum and materials regarding health and wellness were distributed to residential locations. People learned about physical, intellectual, emotional, social, spiritual, and vocational health and wellness, hand hygiene, how laughter, music, and focusing on one's breath can impact one's mood and well-being, nutrition, and more. People also did chair exercises and deep breathing exercises. Also this week, program participants at Old Plank Studio played Minute to Win It games in honor of the Summer Olympics. People earned gold medals in exchange for their excellent display of skill. In Wilmington, people enjoyed watching a pet parade downtown that was part of 2021 Catfish Days. New Lenox Woodworks began doing custom laser engraving on items. A leather belt with custom engraving is pictured. Contact the program at 815-463-4692 to inquire about pricing and other items the program can customize. Proceeds benefit people with disabilities who attend the program. Last weekend, our support business Petals and Twigs welcomed pets and pet parents to its Barkery event. The store collected donations for NAWS in Mokina, and proceeds from sales benefited people supported by Trinity. And yesterday, our support business High Tide Press held a virtual author event featuring Dr. Tim Williams reflecting on the life and works of the late Dr. Dale Turner. Turner had a popular column in the Seattle Times for many years that was syndicated to other large papers nationwide. He drew upon religious principles, but generally wrote about life, growth, values, love, and justice. And he encouraged people to take action for the change they wanted to see in the world. To learn more about Turner and his works, and to view a recording of the presentation, click the link in the post accompanying this video. Looking ahead, on Tuesday at our support business Roxy Special Event Venue in Lockport, the Falconeers Orchestra will perform from 7 to 9.30 p.m. There is a $5 cover at the door. We are planning our 32nd annual Better Together Dinner Dance and Auction set for September 18th at the Odyssey in Tinley Park, and we are looking for auction items for the event. If you have any new home, automotive, beauty, entertainment, or similar items you do not plan on using, or if you have a connection with a business that might be willing to donate a gift certificate, item, or service, please send us a message. Donations will make a difference in the success of the event and will benefit the people we support. We also have many sponsorship and advertisement opportunities available. Visit trinityservices.org slash dinnerdance for more information. Since our last update, two people we support and one staff member tested positive for the coronavirus. We hope everyone impacted makes a quick, full recovery. We continue to adhere to guidance from the CDC and the Illinois Department of Public Health in regards to mitigating the spread of the coronavirus. Masks, social distancing, and regular cleaning of high-touch surfaces are required in common areas of homes, in office settings, and at day programs. Staff members and people we support who are unvaccinated are required to get tested for the coronavirus regularly and we continue to encourage vaccination for anyone medically eligible. Given the rising positivity rates in many of our communities, especially in the Mascuda area, we will need to temporarily adopt more restrictive visitation rules. If you are planning visits in the near future, please contact your network director or associate to develop a safety plan, which will include testing for people who have been away from their group home. Thank you for your ongoing support. Together, we are Trinity Strong. Stay safe, and we'll see you next week.